Welcome to this web snippet on alternate position drawing views. Here in SolidWorks, I've got an assembly of a door. It's a pretty simple assembly, and it's got some various configurations showing whether these bolts are in or out, whether the handle's up or down. Now, if we're doing a drawing of this, we may want to show the range of motion of the handle and whether the bolts are in or out. Now, we can do this using the functionality that's taught in the training course and use alternate position view where we select our drawing view, we choose alternate position, we can choose to create a new configuration and drag components around, or we can choose to use our existing configurations that we've already made. And it brings on a dotted outline showing where the move components go to. And I can repeat this again for my other configuration. Now this gives us quite a nice image on the handle, but it doesn't make it necessarily so clear whether these bolts are in or out in the various configurations. So what we can do is we can also show the different configurations individually. We have here our default configuration and we can drag in some other views. Doesn't matter which view we drag in, we can drag it in, we can then switch it so it's the front view as we want. And then what we can do is we can pick which configuration is being used. So we can choose open and it shows the handle down and the latch in. We can then bring in another view Again, we can switch it so we're looking at the front and choose the other configurations. So we can choose locked. So very simply, we can see that in the default configuration, we have one bolt out, open no bolts out, and locked all three bolts out. Very similar functionality to the alternate position, three views a little bit more detail. Thank you very much for watching.